When discussing the electrical industry as a trade, one of the reasons we give for why it's a good choice for young people is a person can earn while they learn. They can avoid the crushing weight of college debt. In other words, they can avoid college altogether. And that's true enough for electricians and technicians. But for our NECA contractor base, the Ying to the IBEW Yang, where do they find their next estimator, project manager, or designer? Somewhat ironically, in college. And one of the best places for doing this can be found in a happy valley in Pennsylvania, through the experiences of two seniors in the club. I have a background in architecture from the University of Pittsburgh. So I grew up in uh, Fallsington, Pennsylvania. It's down near the Philadelphia side. I got into Penn State because my uh, parents went there, my grandparents went there, so I'm third generation, me and my brother. So I transferred to architectural engineering, uh, which is what brought me to Penn State. Coming into college, I wasn't 100% sure what I wanted to do. I knew I wanted to do something engineering because I've always been a very math brain. I was interested at first in structural, but I actually found out through the first couple classes they have us take that I was more interested in the lecture. And that was the class where I met Dr. Asadi and got involved in uh, NECA. Students are involved with a lot of theory-based material that they learn in the classroom, but they have very limited opportunities to be engaged in real-world application and hands-on experiences. So what NECA brought to us was filling this gap. So I knew nothing about NECA. I had never heard of it. I would have told you it was NECA. You want to get involved in the club because you want to try and find job opportunities, obviously. But the club also gives you opportunities to learn about what you're going to be doing for the rest of your life. They've got a real thirst to know, as engineers, why, you know, does something work the way it works? And how do I apply that? The value or the opportunities I see for the NECA student group is being able to actually see construction up close actually hear contractors talk about what they do on a daily basis or how they interface with the design team on a construction project. I found a summer internship with an electrical contractor, uh, Hassel & Bueller. I got a leadership position in one of the leading clubs at our university. And then I got this chance to go down to Austin to go see the Nika Convention and get to compete in this really great competition. I think we did a lot better than we expected to. It was really rewarding. This competition and this program is something that students would benefit a lot. And the way that they are doing it right now, with all the teaching material and the support that they are providing to students, this is something that is very great. And I'm sure all the students who are part of this chapter are thankful for that. And they are using these resources very well. The point of NECA is to get people involved in the electrical contracting industry, but this is how we uh, get people into jobs. They're growing to the point where when they graduate, if they're in our electrical option, they are ready to, to work day one as an electrical designer. So everyone I graduate with, all me and my friends, we're going to have uh, career paths that we're going to be set on right at graduation. For me, it was definitely worth it. If you had asked me before I started at NECA, was it something that I saw myself being this involved in? I probably would have said no, but like I said, I really did fall in love with the experience of being a part of this group, even though I didn't have the background. And at the end of the day, that's the ultimate goal of any NECA student chapter developing relationships and attracting tomorrow's best and brightest today. For Electric TV, I'm Dominic Giratano. Be sure to follow us on social media for behind the scenes extras and industry information.